Celine Dion, that's her classic, My Heart Will Go On. And she gave her heart and soul to her husband of more than 20 years, Renee, who passed away yesterday. ABC's Deborah Roberts has their love story. For Celine Dion, it was the loss of her greatest love of all, husband Renee Angeline. The renowned singer posting on her Facebook page, it is with deep sadness that we announce that Renee, aged 73, died after a long and courageous fight against cancer. The singer seemed to know the end was near when I met her last March, sharing with me how Renee, her longtime manager, insisted that she get back on the stage despite his heartbreaking second battle against throat cancer. Sometimes, and I think I'm used to it, don't feel what you, what you need to feel. Just do it. Go on stage. <laughs> I did. Because you're a showbiz veteran, you know how to... No, because I love him. And I did, and uh, it was very hard. I realized that I couldn't do both. Renee frail, but bravely standing by his wife's side. Months later, the superstar singer making a courageous and emotional return. The two met when Celine was just 12 years old, Renee, 38, shaping her into one of the most successful singers in the world. Celine telling ABC News this past November about Renee's perseverance. We all learned so much from him, and I'm, I will always be very thankful. The couple, who recently celebrated their 21st wedding anniversary, had three children together. For Good Morning America, Deborah Roberts, ABC News, New York. This one is a real heartbreak. It is, mm -hmm. and I remember when Deb came back from doing that, and just, uh, they knew that the time was going to be not what they wanted, and that she was going to spend as much time with him as possible and you could just feel every time you were in their presence you felt the love felt between those love. two it was a true yeah. love story